Hey guys, welcome to On Fire Roblox Scripting, and we just hit 300 subscribers. Well, not the time of recording this, but by the time this video is uploaded, it should be 300 subscribers, which is very epic. So thank you guys all for 300 subscribers. Now to celebrate, I did ask my Discord and YouTube um, for some game ideas and mechanics, and I'm gonna put them all into one game. So I first asked my Discord, so let's see what they came up with. So, so our first game mechanic is from Otoke Man. So basically, he's got a cool game mechanic called Random Gravity Change. So every few seconds, uh, gravity on the world changes. So you can be like, so you can jump high or like barely jump. Uh, so basically, the way you change gravity, if like if you go into the workspace into the properties and the gravity is right there so i'm thinking that we just go here we add in a script let's name it uh random gravity change and then let's just go like of the workspace right now gravity is 400 oh I see okay never mind the higher the gravity uh, the lower we can jump so we actually want to cap this at probably 200 and let's go to like 5 5 to 200 so now we should be able to jump uh, decently high actually so let's go test it out now should probably work i thought like the higher the gravity uh the more you could jump but now i think about it that's pretty stupid um oh yeah so right now we can jump higher than normal that's good to know and now we can jump like super high which is very good okay so i think this is exactly what i want pretty good gravity if you ask me Whee. yeah yeah, okay, I'm gonna go with this gravity. So yeah, that's game mechanic one. Let's just hop right into the second one. Okay, so our second game idea slash mechanic is also from our Discord server. And this is submitted by uh, exclamation mark Gabby. Whenever you walk, a rock falls that deals one point of damage. So I actually don't know how to code that and you will see that there's walls here now because this is actually going to be our map so what i'm just going to make it is so that like um basically there's just rocks i guess um but like you can just walk over the rocks i guess something like that and then i'm, I'm not too sure because i don't really know how to code falling rocks that's actually pretty hard to make so i think um yeah i actually do not know how to make falling rocks that's pretty hard uh so i think i'm just gonna like put rocks all across the map but if you like hit them um you will get damage and obviously you can escape them and the whole point of this game will be trying to escape them so that's gonna be cool let's name this rock and let's change it to like a rock color maybe give it like uh, how about like concrete no that looks weird pebble sure pebble let's make it not anchored because we don't exactly need it anchored cast shadow no i don't want shadow and yeah that should be it and then i just need to add in the script so I'm just gonna call the script deal damage. So deal damage. There we go. And then I'm just gonna write uh, local. Wait, no, actually. Script dot parent dot touch colon connect function. And it's gonna be hit. And then if if hit and hit dot parent colon find first child and then we're gonna write humanoid uh, then uh, 
kit dot parent dot humanoid dot health minus equal one and I'm just gonna test it out before I duplicate like a billion of them. Okay, just spawned in. Oh, we've got pretty good gravity right now. That's pretty cool. Okay, so if we run over the rocks, we do take a lot of damage. So I suggest you don't stay on top of the rocks and they do move, so that is pretty cool. Great, so let's uh, duplicate them. Uh, time lapse. Okay, great. So now we've got like a whole bunch of rocks. We'll just uh, group them. And then we'll call them rocks. Great. So that is two out of five game mechanics done. So let's move on to our YouTube comments for some more game mechanics. Okay, so our third game mechanic is submitted by Court Zap. Added plane that has uh, moving propellers and it can hold people. Uh, as much as I want to make a plane, I can't. Which sucks. But like, what I can do, um, is make very tall pillars that you can jump on to escape all of these scary rocks. So like this one you're gonna need pretty high gravity. But I'm just gonna call this a pillar and I'm going to anchor it. And I'm just gonna put like these all over the map. Cool. So that's going to be the third game mechanic out of five. Let's go right on to the fourth. So next one is I really want to do a bike game. I guess that's a great idea from Kermromil. Sorry if I pronounced your name wrong. I'm not good at pronouncing names. Uh, so bikes, like bikes, motorcycles, that kind of stuff. Okay, sure. Let's try that out. Uh, this one was honestly pretty easy um but yeah that's four out of five um that one went pretty quick but let's go on our very last game mechanic so the last game mechanic we have is submitted by court vexes he's actually a friend of mine a pretty cool guy and as you can see on his profile picture he has a big blue head and he commented make a big blue head so I guess we're making a big blue head. And let's put him back in starter characters. No, starter player. And let's go test it out one more time. And, uh, okay, there you go. Everything works perfectly normal now. You can ride your bike in one direction. Now, unfortunately, um, uh, you know, changing the head does not work. So unfortunately, um, I couldn't do big blue head. Um, but if you do escape, there are big blue heads everywhere around the map, so that is cool. And uh, yeah, basically the whole goal is to try to escape this place. Obviously, you can use outdated guns, um, jumping that is super weird and can be pretty frustrating. But like, remember, if you do get out, you'll be greeted by a whole bunch of blue heads so yeah that'll be can this guy face this direction okay so so that'll be it for this tutorial if you liked it make sure you like comment subscribe and share uh might make like another one like this uh who knows it's pretty fun um and i know you're saying like there's no blue head out there right now uh i, I will be adding them before making this uh video public so that'll be cool anyways thanks for watching um bye anyways thanks for watching the video sorry for you know the weird recordings near the end of the video i can't really do much about it um but yeah thanks for 300 subscribers that is just very epic and um pog 
Uh, subscribe on the left. Um, you know, we could reach 400 pretty soon. Watch a video on the right. Bye.